Speaker, we can have the Island manager, Danny Hill, following our 4 0 win against Cray Wanderers at Prospect Stadium. Danny, a good win and a clean sheet. What were your thoughts on the match? I thought it was a really good professional performance today. I said uh, it was a potential banana skin. Obviously, they're bottom of the league, but so they're not a bad side. But um, it, the, win, the win today was very tricky. The conditions, but I thought we dealt with them better. But um, I say I knew, I knew that first half we was against the wind and we went in at one 0 up. So I knew we had the fate um, like it was going in our favour, and, and I knew the second half would be a comp totally different game just due to the wind and that, and it, it proved to be. So I'm uh, glad to have a clean sheet and glad to get four goals on the board as well. 1-0 at half-time, uh, missed a couple of chances late on as well to extend that lead. Were there any thoughts in your back in mind that we've been here before? Yeah, not really. I just thought we'd, we dominated the game from start to finish uh, in tricky conditions and uh, we dealt with it really well. And uh, as I say, 1-0 one, one obviously, when we was 1-0 at half-time and we missed a couple when the, uh, on the stroke of half-time where we could have gone into or 3-0 up. The faults of the Thamesmead game come into the back of your mind and that, and you've got to finish teams off. But no, we scored at the right times today in the second half and uh, we, we, we dominated the game today. We've now put a few uh, results together in a run. Uh, what are your hopes now going forward into uh, the Christmas period over the new year? Yeah, so no, we, we, we've picked up points. So we're unbeaten in four. Now. We've had two wins and, and, and two draws. And uh, I, I just think that we're going in the right direction. But we've got a good bunch of players here. The atmosphere at the club's good. And uh, so we, we've got a busy Christmas period coming up with some tough games. I think we played like five of the top seven in the, over Christmas and everything. But uh, we're, we're ready for it. And, that, and we're just... Uh, we're in our team to beat at times, so hopefully we can continue that and, and uh, pick up some points through the Christmas period. Finally, it was a good day for the club today with uh, a lot of the Canvey Island youth sides here today, having a big squad photo and then being uh, being trained by some of the first team squad. Uh, how how pleased were you to see that kind of integration between the main club and the youth club and how important is that going to be for the future of the club? Oh, no, that's right. So for, for, the, for the kids, I think we had nearly 100, 100 odd kids here today like on the pitch before the game, having a photo with the first team and that, and that's what it's all about. So, uh, some of them boys are the future, do you know what I mean? So hopefully some of them come through to the first team in the years to come. But no, it's what it's all about. And it, it boosts the gate up as well. And we put on a good performance for them today. And uh, hopefully we'll get a few of them come back uh, more often. Thanks, Dan. Well done. Tom, mate.